All right, see that store right there? That's what we're going to be doing. Pharmacy has two, four, five windows in and out. There's a little bit of scraping involved, but uh, y'all tell me how much y'all will charge. So I'm going to have my old time sarsaparilla. Anybody know what sarsaparilla is? You're showing your age, but this is good stuff. It's almost similar to birch beer or, um, you know, birch beer, uh, sarsaparilla, it's, it's, it's in that family, root beer, it's sort of in that family. You have to taste it to understand, but you can only get these at like the very, very good nutritional stores. Uh, GSC, I don't think we'll have it, but, uh, you know, like a home mom and pop type of nutrition store. They'll have sarsaparilla and things like that. And seeing as how it's, uh, you know, this time of the year, I got pumpkin pie soda. It's made from Maine. This ought to be real interesting. Pumpkin pie soda. Hmm. I'm going to try this out later. Al? Yeah. Uh, did you want to do this just one time or uh, frequently? Uh, every week or every couple of weeks? I'd say every couple of weeks. At least. Especially the outside with the salt on this time of year. They're going to get nasty. But uh, it just helps me out if I can come and clean it and not have it where it's so bad. Well, I got to spend too so much time. Big difference, right? Big difference. You said it smells nice, huh? It smells nice too. You, can you guess what's in my water? No. You can't put your finger on it, can you? Hey, it's pine saw. Pine saw, wow. Yeah, you wouldn't think pine saw would smell pleasant like that. Because yeah. I don't like pine too yeah, much. I, yeah. You got to be a piney kind of person. But this particular pine saw is called uh, Sunburst or Sun Wave. It's blue. Okay. And it has a nice, uh, clean smell to it. So I, I thought of putting it in my water. Okay. Little did I know, I right. got so many compliments because people kept asking, oh, what is that smell? What are you using? Right. And then it makes the windows come out nice and that, nice man, and clean. It looks like a brand new window. <laughs> <laughs> now you got to keep them clean. Exactly. That's, the key. That's the key right there. That's right. Wow. Good job, man. Good, job. Good. I'm glad. Tell all your friends. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because I do residential too, so oh, okay. houses. Houses too. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. I'll write you out a receipt. All right, cool. Yeah. Nice, nice. Yeah, thanks. I didn't realize that makes a big difference. Just the window looking like Oh, that. yeah. Well, see, that's the thing. Some people get accustomed to seeing it. Yeah. You don't really know how bad it is until yeah. once you clean it. You're like, whoa, they, they needed it. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. Yeah, believe it or not, it makes a difference. It helps bring the light in and exactly. people can actually see what's, see going, what's going on. on. Yeah. If you got an obstruction like that, right. it kind of dulls everything out. Absolutely. You know, yeah. image is everything in some exactly. people's eyes. Yeah. You know? yeah. They're like, well, that place don't look too clean. I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> I don't come in here. Yeah. yeah, food is different. Right. They, they got to stay looking nice. Right, you know? right, right. But, 
But this is medications too. He's, he's still got to look good too. Yeah, yeah. People like, you know, I don't know if I want to get my medicine. You know? Yeah, images, everything. Yeah. You know, that's just like a, a auto shop. Right. If you bring in your Mercedes in there, you look around, you see all this trash in the shop. Exactly. You, you got to wonder, well, exactly. how are they going to keep my car? Is my exactly. car going to be running like trash? <laughs> you know? Right, right. <laughs> miss your place. Your place right. is clean inside. Exactly. It looks it's nice. It's but it was just the windows. Right. But um, they say never judge a book by its cover. But some, it's a shame. But some people do, you know? That's just like the clothes you wear. Right. Just because somebody's walking around with right. the pants out and they ass the butt out right. doesn't necessarily mean they're not a nice person. Exactly. That's just the way that they present themselves and people will hold you to that. Absolutely. Only he got the right to exactly. judge. Exactly. Right, you're right. That's Absolutely. right. All right, I'm glad. Well, you got my four weeks and uh, say, hey, yeah, listen. Absolutely, absolutely. All right. Now I see how it looks. I see the yeah, now you can see my skills. Well, you already saw from next I door. Absolutely. But you had to actually see yours, how it's right. going to look. Exactly. Before we'll take we get a, look a... Again. <laughs> Take a Kodak. Yours, how it's right. going to look. Exactly. Before we'll take we get a look a... Again. <laughs> Take a Kodak picture. Yeah, I, I took a picture. Wow. I always take a picture of my work when I'm done. I okay, another satisfied customer. You see, he was so blown away how nasty his windows look compared to next door. And it's not enough that they're seeing how, how your next door neighbor's business is blowing you away as far as keeping the windows clean because it's making them look bad. And it was making him look bad. He just couldn't stand it anymore. So that's when he came out to talk to me. And I said I would be back. You see, now I guarantee you he's going to get on the horn and call his friends. And invite everybody to uh, take all my, my services. Which is window cleaning. I don't offer any more services, but... I guarantee you, I'll get some more work out of this guy. Guarantee you. But that's what you do when doing route work. You got to go next door, especially if it's been neglected. Because you never know what somebody might need or what. Just because they say no today, don't mean they won't say yes tomorrow or no tomorrow. You know? You just got to keep going back. There you have it. Peace, peace, peace.